Former Commissioner of Police Owen Ellington has added his voice to the response to the announcement of yet another state of public emergency. Speaking Monday during Power 106 FM's morning agenda, Mr. Ellington said what needs to be assessed are the strategies of the security forces that are supported by a state of emergency. The discussion comes in the wake of Sunday's declaration of a state of emergency in the Kingston East Police Division. Mr. Ellington says states of emergency are needed to fill a gap, such as detaining individuals for an extended period. So I have no doubt that the security forces would have presented to the government very credible intelligence on what is happening in the community and what they are able to do with their existing resources and capabilities and therefore what additional powers they need so that they can execute the total strategy and achieve the objectives that they have in mind. Um, and therefore, I am expecting the state of emergency to be limited and specific in terms of the, the, the area over which it is imposed, the, the length of time. He says the strategies of the security forces should be made known. What I don't hear anybody asking, you know, is what are the strategies of the security forces that they need to execute and for which they are requesting these extraordinary powers, privileges and immunities. These are the things that the community can actually assist in holding the security forces accountable to implementing. In the meantime, Mr. Ellington agrees that states of emergency should also be time-bound. Yes, certainly, for a number of reasons. One of them is that the declaration of the state of emergency over a community imposes certain restrictions on civil liberties. So you can't have that going indefinitely because what you're actually asking on the citizens to do is give up something more in return for. And if what is promised is not delivered, then the state of emergency loses its legitimacy. And if you lose public support for these extraordinary measures, then they become ineffective. Stevie and Winter, Frontline News.